Hey guys, welcome back to my channel, Dune and Vixen. It's Kathy. And yes, I know many of you have been asking, hey Kathy, where have you been? Well, the question really should be, hey Kathy, where haven't you been? <laughs> I feel like I've been everywhere since I was last here. I ended up taking a break. I didn't mean to take such a long break, but <sighs> literally time flies especially when you get busy, 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 busy doing, um, well, you know, working, being a mom, and then of course, just living life. I still am so busy. I don't really have a whole lot of time for myself, which um, I really need to try to make a little more time for myself. And part of making time for myself is making videos and sharing products with you. Now, while I was on a break, I received a few emails from different viewers asking me if I could review their products or at least share their products with you. I am a big big believer in following your dreams and achieving your goals. And um, just the fact that a few of you have asked me to share and review your products is so flattering to me. How could I resist? And I mean, I have, I couldn't say no, I had to, I have to share with, um, with the world what you have done. And the fact that you have a lot of faith in me to get out there and to promote your products says a lot um, about how you feel about me. So thank you. Thank you for, for, for having confidence and faith in me to hopefully um, help promote your product. In addition to sharing um, some of these new products with you that I have been asked to promote, um, I'm gonna share a couple of other new favorite products that I've discovered um, while I was away. <laughs> I shouldn't say away because you know when Teresa from Real Housewives of New Jersey says she was away, well, we all know where she was. I wasn't there. <laughs> I was just busy, 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 busy. And I'll tell you where I was. I'll put some pictures up at the end of this video and you can see what I've been doing um, in the past. Gosh, has it been a year? Oh, I hope it hasn't been a year, but it might have been. Yeah. Well, let's get started. I was contacted by a viewer. Her name is Adora. Adora contacted me because she created a skincare line. Um, I guess she had been trying different products and couldn't find the exact recipe to um, pinpoint her exact needs for her skin. So she came up with her own line to address her issues. So this is what she came up with. It's called High Spirits. This is the very, very, very generous um, sample that she sent me. Um, these are everything that came in there. She has a card that says um, thank you from small business and it has her information. Here's her information. If you want to look at that, I'll also link her info below. Adora also included this letter that explained why she started her skincare line. I won't read the whole letter, but I will um, read the highlights of it. Um, she was born in Dallas, Texas. Um, let's see. She says, I've always had a dream of starting my own business that would impact other women in a positive way. After struggling for many years with my own skin and finding that all of other brands weren't working for me. I decided to create my own products. And so here we are. My brand is about empowerment, self-confidence, and charitability. I strongly believe you definitely reflect those things, which is why I'm so proud that you would review my products. Anyway, that was so sweet. But I am so far very, very impressed. So let me show you what came in my sample box. So it looks like we have a choice of vitamin C, or peptide, or you can use them both. So I know the peptides really help to plump up the skin and the vitamin C really helps with um, hyperpigmentation of your skin. So I really do feel like if you use a combination of these products, you're gonna be really, really happy and very pleased. This is what came in my box, a peptide cleanser and the peptide complex moisturizer. So here's the peptide complex moisturizer. It's very nice. It's very um, lightweight. It doesn't feel sticky and it doesn't feel um, oily. You know, well, sometimes with moisturizers, especially anti-aging moisturizers, they can feel a little sticky or moily, or moily. oily, <laughs> making your skin seem greasy on your I can just tell those peptides are just being absorbed into my skin right now as I rub it in. It has a very, very light fragrance. Mm. You know, I'm not one who doesn't like fragrance. Some people prefer fragrance free products. I do like a little bit of fragrance in my in my skincare and any of the products I use because it makes me feel like a girl. Um, and I'm a girly girl. Here's the vitamin C cream. 
and this is oh and let's see how this feels Ooh. this is also very nice and lightweight but you know I can definitely feel it being um, moisturizing you know sometimes when they're a little too lightweight you don't feel like they're moisturizing enough but I can definitely feel that this is a very very nice a nice cream I'm really really looking forward to using this to seeing how well it helps with my hyperpigmentation I've had to kind of change up my skincare routine a little bit too so I'm so happy that I have some new products to um to and try. this also came with it a 20% vitamin C serum this is also very very nice I think everyone of a certain age needs a good vitamin C serum and 20% is a very very good percentage of the vitamin C to have in your skin. Another little treat Adora included in my package was this derma roller. You know derma rollers are all the rage. This one is a 0.25 so I'd say this is like derma roller um, beginner derma roller but if you use this in combination with this the vitamin C serum That'll really, really help the vitamin C absorb into your skin. And I think you're going to have such amazing thank results. Thank you. Thank you, Adora, for sharing your high spirits essentials with me. I'm going to get the word out. I want everyone to try it. Oh, I also forgot she added this. Oh, this is also in the box. But you can tell I've already started using it. This is... <laughs> It's a little makeup kit. I kind of, you can kind of tell it's been broken in. I've been carrying this in my purse and I have, oh, all kinds of um, lipsticks and all kinds of good stuff in there. But um, she probably actually wants us to um, put the products in there, but I have used it for something else. I use this for my traveling bag when I go to work. If you want to try Adora's High Spirits Essential Skincare line, I think you're really, really going to like it. The link's below. Click on it, check her out. Another product that I was asked to try is the Nature Queen Premium Herbal Shampoo and Conditioner. This is a very, very nice um, shampoo and conditioner. It is um, paraben free with no chemicals, no artificial fragrance. Now, I will tell you one thing about this particular shampoo. I love the pumps. <laughs> I, love, I love, this is sample size. I love the sample size. This is like the perfect size. But look, you can see it's kind of a darker shampoo. But it smells very um, herbal. It reminds me a little bit of um, Lush. I have a shampoo from Lush, and it's in um, a bar. It's a bar shampoo, and I bought that for traveling because you know when you're traveling. Now, as a flight attendant, they let us get by with bigger bottles of liquids than just the average passenger. However, when I go um, traveling on my own, I have to comply with regular passenger rolls when it comes to liquids and so I decided that I wanted to carry everything in my my carry-on bag and I bought the um, the bar soap from Lush so that it would eliminate the shampoo part and I could put more other things in my little bag anyway that's what this reminds me of and this is supposed to stimulate hair growth so oh this smells so good I haven't actually tried it yet. Wanted to share it with you in case you're looking for um, a very natural um, hair product and smells luscious. I will say the fragrance is a little more of an herbal, um, stronger herbal fragrance. So just be warned that um, you may smell a little hippie-ish, but if you like that, this one's for you. I was asked to um, share this. This is called La Biarritz Rejuve Therapy. It's a moisturizer, Phyto Stem Cell Moisturizing Cream. You guys, I, I can't get enough of moisturizing creams. I love, I love products. I love when people ask me to try their products. This is um, Phyto Stem Cell Moisturizing Cream. What are the benefits of this? Let's see. It um, moisturizes, instantly hydrates, and helps improve the appearance of aging. Well, hello. Who doesn't want to improve the appearance of aging? So, I'll give you a first impression. I put a little bit right here on my hand. Now, this one's a little thicker, a little bit thicker than the High Spirits. So, this would probably be a really, really nice um, product that you would want to use when you, maybe your skin's just a little drier than normal. It'd be great 
for use after a facial, if you're doing your own mask or a facial, or if you're doing your own home microdermabrasion, or even um, a TCA peel. But yes, oh my gosh, this is really nice. One thing about the Phyto Stem Cell, I know it's supposed to regenerate some of the collagen production that is um, lost in our skin as we age, and it will help to increase the elasticity of your skin. And I will link this below too if you'd like to try this, but yeah, this is a really nice one. This is a nice creamy product as well. So thank you, thank you La, La Buritz. <laughs> For sharing your product with me. The products that I fell in love with while I was on a break that I actually purchased. Here's one. Oh my gosh. I'm crazy about this hairspray. Big Sexy Hair. Who makes this? By Just Sexy Hair. Spray and play. Seven hold. This stuff is great. My hair is stick stick straight. This stuff keeps it um, just gives it the body and keeps it in shape all day long. I love it. I keep a can of this in my bathroom and I also have a can in my travel bag. Like I said, they let us carry larger things in our bags as a working crew member, and thank goodness because I don't think I'd go anywhere without this particular hairspray. Love it. Love it. I'm also loving this FEG eyelash enhancer. This stuff is pretty amazing. I took my lash extensions off, gosh, maybe six months ago. I've been using this every single day, and oh, my lashes have never looked better. That's all I have to say. I love it. This is what it looks like, comes with a little brush. I'm gonna do a video on this to show you exactly how um, I do make my lashes look like um, lash extensions. So stay tuned for that. Here's another pretty amazing all natural product that I was asked to review, gosh, oh, a while back, a while back. And I did do a review, I did an unboxing of um, the Nudu products. And um, they sent this to me, this is the Renew cream. This is an overnight radiance renew cream. And what makes this a radiance cream? Well, this one contains daffodil stem, stem cells and licorice root extract, which help reduce the appearance of dark spots. So if you want to try to go a little more natural and achieving a more even skin tone, helping with hyperpigmentation, this is a wonderful, wonderful product. Thank you, Nudu, for sharing this with me. I really like this one too. You know, a lot of times I'll just take these products like this and I'll just throw them in my bag and I use them on my trips, which I love, which is great. I love them because they're very portable. They're small. And um, sometimes it's just a really good way to try products out. I really find that when I'm flying, my skin gets so dry. So um, I love I just always love, I just love skincare products. And when I find a great product, I have to share it with you. So thank you once again to Nudu for, for sharing this product with me as well. I love the other products in your line that you sent me. And now it's fun to have a night um, overnight cream. I did find that the products that they did send me before, I liked them. They were good for day use. But um, I will say they didn't seem um, creamy enough or I should say moisturizing enough for night use. So I'm glad they came out with an overnight um, cream. Okay, so back to the question of what have you been up to? Well, I'd say the last time I saw you, I've been doing a lot of traveling. I'll go over some of the highlights with you. I've kind of gone back to flying international. I am back to um, going to Asia. I just recently discovered Singapore. Singapore is, oh my gosh, one of the most amazing cities in the world I've ever been to. It sure is a heck of a long way to get there. It's 18 hours to fly from LAX to Singapore, which I think may be the longest um, flight um, right now in the world, 18 hours. So I've added that to my route. You know, people always ask, oh, what's your route, what's your route? Well, you know what, I've added Singapore to my route and I am loving it loving it there isn't a whole lot of shopping I should say a lot of shopping that you can't really do here it's kind of an expensive city compared to the states but um, the sightseeing and the food are amazing so I'm really really looking forward to going back there a few more times <laughs> hopefully <laughs> least a few more times in my lifetime. So much to explore there. Last time I was there, I went to these beautiful, beautiful gardens by the bay, which are located really, really close to, um, oh my gosh, this landmark of a hotel called the Marina Bay Sands Motel, which has a beautiful pool on the top of the hotel. It has an infinity pool.
which if you want to swim in the pool, you have to be a registered guest. I was not a registered guest, but I did go to the restaurant up next to it and got a really, really good view of the, of the pool. So I'll share that with you. And oh, what a neat, neat experience. Um, I am going back next month. I'm really looking forward to that. I've also added China to my route. Um, I went to Shanghai for the first time and I have no idea why I waited so long to go. That city is pretty amazing too. I guess I always felt like China was a little intimidating because it is a communist country. Um, but I don't know. It, it, it wasn't quite how I thought it would be. And so I plan on going back there too. The shopping is a lot of fun. You get some really, really good bargains over there because a lot of the products that we receive here in the States that are made in China are made there. So you can get a lot of um, really good deals just straight from the source, if you know what I mean. So that's a really, really fun place. And then for fun, I took my son, Dominic, to Sydney last summer. We had the best time. I asked my husband and my daughter if they wanted to come with us. And they said, heck no, but it wasn't heck no. <laughs> they said they were not getting on a plane that long to end up in um, a country that was in the middle of winter. Yes, I will say, Australia was in the middle of their winter in August when I did decide to go with Dominic. However, it was kind of the only time I could take him because he was out of school. So we decided to go anyway. We went down there. It wasn't that cold, but oh my gosh, we had the most amazing experience. And plus it was really, really good just to go and have mommy sun time. We don't get to have that time a lot um, together. You know, he's really into sports. So he and dad do um, a lot of sports type things. And so um, it was really neat to be able to share that with him as well. And just really, really just travel with him. He is ready to go back. In fact, he said he wanted to go to Singapore. After I showed him all the pictures of Singapore, he wanted to go there with me. Um, so who knows? Maybe we'll go to Singapore. I don't know. But we had so much fun in Sydney. Um, Jim and Sophie did say that um, maybe they would go back with us this summer. <laughs> I guess they decided that it looked like it could have been fun even in the winter, but I think this time we'll go a little further north where it's a little warmer. I'll keep you posted on that if we do end up doing that. But um, I'd say our next trip that we're planning is probably just to Hawaii for a few days over spring break. Spring break's on its way, so um, we might just pop over there for a couple days just to have a good time. But anyway, that's just a quick little update on what's been going on with me, some new products I wanted to share with you, and um, some of my new favorite products that I've discovered in the past, gosh, I guess it has been about a year since I last saw you. Anyway, hopefully it won't be another year before I get back to share more wonderful products with you. So hopefully you'll come back and see me check in every now and then. If you enjoyed this video, please feel free to give me a thumbs up. If you like my channel and haven't subscribed and would like to, please feel free to do so. Leave me a comment. I love hearing from you. I try to get back to everybody, but I can't always. And um, if you have any products you want to share with me, feel free to contact me. I'm more than happy to share anything with the world and put your links below. And once again, I'm very flattered when people ask me to do that. So thank you. Thank you to everybody. Thank you for watching. And I will see you very soon. Bye.